Over a third of the 1,800 plus student body boycotted American high school today following two days of violence last week. Classrooms looked relatively empty as parents kept some 700 students home until they feel the school is safe. Principal Glenda Harris, who appears to be very popular with both parents and students, said the school is undergoing a period of stress that last Thursday a girl was seriously hurt. It appears that she's going to have to have surgery. I don't know. I haven't talked with the parents this morning. And uh, how about Friday? As far as we can determine, Friday was a continuation of what did happen on Thursday, except that it involved friends of the youngster who was hurt on uh, Thursday. And it did involve outsiders. Some of the boycotting students and parents gathered at a nearby park to discuss the situation. American High's population is evenly divided among Anglos, Cubans, and blacks. I just don't want the kids hurt. It's simply that. Uh, I you think it's family. basically a racial problem? It seems that way. School is a beautiful school. It's a brand new school. We have everything we could want, except the people that go to the school don't give a crap about the school. They don't care about the school. The troublemakers, and they should be kicked out for good. Regardless of how long the boycott lasts, there will be a meeting this Friday night with all the parents and the school principal. In the meantime, both the parents and the students are supporting the boycott, saying that they'll stay out until something is done. The problem is no one seems to know what that something is. Joan Hall, Channel 4 News.